How's it going? Not too bad, not Good. too bad. So everything's in there. Okay, perfect. It all works okay? Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. It's yeah, okay. it's like it hasn't been... We haven't used it in probably two years. Okay. Yeah, it's like brand new. My kids use it, so... Awesome, perfect, awesome. So there's 125 for you. Awesome. Thank, Thank you very much. Thank you so much. All right. Have a good day. Take care. Okay guys, so I just got out of there. I just bought this awesome Wii U bundle. I'm really, really, really trying to stay away from the Wii U's. They just don't sell that well. I did have to lower the price on them. Uh, I was getting 140 for Wii U's up until a couple months ago. They really started to slow down and I've been getting them a lot and not purposely. I keep getting them in bundles that are just really good and I kind of can't turn them down. So I'm really not trying to get any more Wii U's because I haven't even sold the Wii U in probably like a month. So that's really not good. The only reason I ended up buying this guys was really just for a really quick uh, Close to Christmas flip normally I wouldn't probably buy this but since it's so close to Christmas I'm pretty sure I can just go in right after filming this take the Wii U and bundle these two games here and make most of our money back That's the only reason I did it. Um, but you guys enough talking about it. Let's hop right into this Okay guys, so we paid $125 for everything you're about to see. He had it originally listed for $250, I think, but by the time I saw it, it was marked down to $125, which is a lot more reasonable. I'm surprised it didn't sell, because that's a really good deal, uh, and the Wii U's in like mint condition, so that's just like a pretty good deal for a working uh, nice condition Wii U. We paid $125. What I'm probably going to do is take the Wii U, which is really nice, and bundle it with these two games here for like 120 or like 115 just get it gone get it sold get some money back and then we literally just have to make back five dollars plus our gas uh for the rest of this stuff so take out these two and the wii u that leaves us with the mario kart uh oh you guys couldn't see this uh we got mario kart 8 easy 25 dollar game right now uh around christmas uh and then we got uh planes disney planes I actually do have this, I think, but my copy is not as nice. This one is complete, and it has, like, the manual, um, which I don't think mine has the manual, and the disc is mint. Uh, Planes is actually, like, a 20 ish dollar game, guys, so definitely keep your eyes out for that. And then, yeah, like I said, Mario Kart, easy $25. Two other really good games that came with, uh, Mario Party 10, easy $35, $40 game right now. Uh, I only see that going up because I feel like there's not a lot of Mario Party 10s as opposed to like 8s or 9s. Actually, 9s pretty uncommon. I will admit 9 is pretty hard to come by. Minecraft Wii U Edition right now. That's an easy $20, $25 game. By the time this video comes out, it should be after Christmas, so it might not be going for 20 25 but at the moment it is. So I should be able to list that for like 20 or 25 and get it gone really quickly. Uh, just trying to do really quick flips with Wii U's, guys. I don't want to have them uh, anymore or have to deal with them. Like Switches are just kind of the thing now, and with Switch lights being pretty cheap, I feel like people are kind of going that route instead of the Wii U's now, whereas the Wii U's were kind of the cheaper to the Switch option before. Uh, now, it's like you can just get a switch light and they can play with their friends but yeah guys and then we also got uh this uh nintendo wii u pro controller definitely uh be on the lookout for that official ones go for like 40 45 i usually sell mine for 45 should get at least 40 guaranteed awesome perfect i'm sure it works it probably just doesn't have battery um because everything else is in really good shape like the buttons are mint and then it came with two uh unofficial uh wii remotes uh, especially around Christmas, I sell out of these all the time, so I need them. I should easily be able to get 20 each for those. People who just want a working Wii remote will definitely pay 20 bucks for those. Um, I have like no third party left. All of mine have sold out at 20 each, so I'm pretty sure I'll get that again. But yeah, guys, that's everything we just picked up uh, for a total of $125. Like I said, we should make most of our money back just off of the Wii U and the Just Dance and the Nintendo Land. And then that leaves us the Mario Kart, planes, the three controllers here, including the official uh, Wii U Pro Controller. And then uh, Mario Party 10 and Minecraft basically for free. So uh, yeah, guys, getting ready for Christmas, trying to stock up as best I can. Sales have been fantastic. I had my best sales day ever even during COVID, so stoked because I've been spending a lot on the collection and just on inventory, so to get a lot of that back, especially in one day, is super nice. But yeah, guys, it should be a really, really easy $100 profit, and uh, you yeah, guys trying to keep away from the Wii U's, but they keep finding me somehow. <laughs> um, but yeah, guys, let's keep it going. Oh. 
How's it going? Got to the right house eventually. Yeah. yeah. Like, uh, you can just set it down if you want. Yeah. How's it going guys? We just picked up an awesome Game Boy bundle. Unfortunately, I just got back to my car and I realized that we didn't really get any footage of the pickup. I don't know what's been going on guys. I got a switch yesterday and I didn't get any footage like my camera shut off for that. And then for this pickup, like literally as soon as he went to show me everything, it cut off. And I don't know why that's happening. Shouldn't be. The only thing I can think of is like I've hurt my hand recently. So maybe I'm accidentally shutting it off. But it's really weird that it's happening uh, two bundles in a row. So I'm really sorry for not getting you guys uh, good footage on this one. We just picked up this awesome Game Boy bundle, guys. We paid $60 for everything. Oh my God. I really wish I got footage. He said he didn't know if they worked. But when I was there, I, I thought I got footage of it he was like hey we can grab like two double a's you can check them over um they looked pretty good um from what i could tell and honestly for 60 bucks i wasn't there long after you guys saw me like the cutoff point for the filming like almost immediately after he i like took a quick look he said he grabbed batteries and i was like you know what man it's good for what's here 60 bucks i can definitely take the risk and uh yeah guys let's just hop right into it Okay guys, so what originally caught my interest was this uh, Pokemon uh, Game Boy Color. I am going to keep it. I do have it, but I really like these things and I'm, I'm going to hold on to it. I actually don't know if it works, so we might uh, test that on uh, camera. I did test the green one really quickly right before I left. It does work, so we'll literally get like our $60 back just off of that. Um, they are all missing the backs, but uh, for $60, bucks, guys, definitely can't complain. Uh, that Pokemon one just looks so nice, um, but yeah we'll literally make all our money back and the rest is all profit it came with some good games too i'm gonna be keeping this one i'm not sure what it goes for come on focus it's a uh, fortress of fear wizards and warriors oh okay cool 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 um yeah i'm not sure what that goes for but that's a collection piece then we got mega man uh just i think mega man i thought this goes for a little more but i guess it's only like a 25 30 dollar game uh, love when I find Game Boy Color games, guys. I am trying to go for as many complete in the box. But uh, we got uh, Walt Disney uh, Magical Racing Tour. Really nice, guys. Sorry about my camera. It doesn't focus. We got a Pokemon Blue, which is always nice. That's a nice $50 bill. We'll be well into the profit um, and still get to keep some stuff. Woody Woodpecker. I feel like that's a rare one. I'm not too sure, but I think so. Super cool, guys. I love finding Game Boy Color. Um, uh, we got a black car at Grand Theft Auto. Oh, we got a mystery game, guys. Uh, maybe we can like uh, test that and see what it is. It's definitely fake. You guys can see that, but uh, we can definitely check that out and see what it is. Um, then we got Tony Hawk. Oh, sorry, Tony Hawk. I'm used to saying Tony Hawk. Matt Hoffman's uh, Pro BMX. Pretty sure that's not a good game. I haven't even gone through all the games. Some weird... Oh, we dropped it. A bunch of chargers and cords and stuff. Cool. Is that a Super Nintendo? Oh, I don't know what that is. I don't know. I don't know what these are either. I don't know. Some weird, like, 36 and one cart. Cool. Um, there are some fakes. Uh, where's the other fake? Uh. Oh, and then another uh, Fortress of Fear, or maybe that's the same one. It might be different. It might be the same. I don't know. All-Star Challenge. Uh, we got Battleship. And there was this really cool... Oh, really cool, guys. Definitely keeping this one. It's uh, the Muppets. I really like the Muppets. Uh, to watch them back in the day where was that one guys, we got this cool uh like pokemon silver and gold like multi-cart it is like fake obviously um i've actually never seen that before so that's pretty cool let me know in the comments down below if you guys have uh heard of that but that's uh pretty cool i'll probably still get like if it works like 20 25 bucks for that because that's uh pretty cool uh super mario land no cover Cool. I'm going to check out the uh, Pokemon Edition uh, Game Boy here in a second, and let's see if this baby works. 
Okay guys, absolutely wicked. Just threw some batteries in there. And uh, voila, I know you guys can't see that very well, but it does light up. Super cool. Let's see, does it got the sound? No, oh, I guess there wouldn't be any sound. But yeah guys, look at that. Look at that baby. Super nice, super nice. Also came with these two like weird, uh, they say Game Boy Color on them. Uh, that one's ripped off. The other one says Game Boy Color. It says like GB Boy, Game Boy Boy. I guess, uh, and then color, and how you would definitely know these are fake, uh, color is spelt, like, the non-American way, and that's a good sign that this is definitely fake, I've never seen these before, but they're definitely fake, and you can tell by the back for sure, I'm not sure if these work, I will put them up in the description, or in the video, if it works, um, I don't think it's worth, like, you know, filming it to see if these work, but I'm sure around Christmas time, guys, I should be able to get, like, 30 bucks, 35 bucks each, so, uh, yeah. Yeah, guys, that's everything we just picked up for a total of 60 bucks. Absolutely insane. We make all our money back just off of these two, uh, Game Boy, uh, knockoffs. And then we still got all these awesome games, Mega Man, Pokemon Blue. We're gonna keep the, uh, the Pokemon, uh, Game Boy Color. Look how nice that is. Oh my god, no back, but still... That'll be the second in my collection. And then we got this cool uh, green Game Boy Color. I actually might keep this. This is really clean. Like, the screen has, like, one little scratch there. But other than that, guys, it might be nicer than mine. So, but yeah, guys, that's everything we just picked up for a total of $60. I think we're going to do really well on this. Hopefully, we can find some more Game Boy stuff. Preferably complete in box, but definitely won't complain. And uh, yeah, guys, let's keep it going.